we have to remember Jupiter is really big. Anyway, we now move on to Saturn. Mine is 100. Here we are, you can see all, all of its moons and also the things it has. Saturn's rings. That's what it's called. Because as you can see all the GUI stuff will go. Here's Saturn. Another gas giant. Famous for its rings. The ring planet. But well, mind you, Jupiter, Uranus, and Saturn all have rings. As opposed to the other ones out here. That, that, look at that. Gorgeous. That's what it would be like on the surface of Saturn. You just see a blue line going across and then with rings. Things. Anyway, I'm not going to visit all the planets here, I'm just going to visit a couple of the silicon ones. I'm sure there's one dodgy planet. Why is it all going out of my head? Normally I know about all this stuff, isn't it? As soon as I try to do a video on it, it just all pops out. Mimas, Prometheus, Janus. You can see all of, all of Mars' moons. But those are Titan. Titan, that's a dodgy one, isn't it? Well, not dodgy, but interesting. But Titan, you have all the moons, and then all this crust as well. And kind of, but, but all scattered about. Not as many as Jupiter, but, but many big moons. That's what Saturn has. Why don't we go to one 
third one's really close to it. Probably an asteroid or dwarf moon, Belinda. Let's go to that bit, it looks really close to the surface to just see what it'll look like if you were on that moon. Orbiting the planet. Oh, maybe it's not as close as I thought. It's just something with a sign. Stupid me. It's actually quite a long way out, isn't it? But this, just an asteroid, a frozen asteroid. side to be able to see the planet itself somewhere. Too much dramatic because I wanted to be come on, come on, come on. Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? Here we go. I thought you would see a Pac Man, which is blue. Yeah. Anyway. Okay now we got on to the last couple. Pluto. Five moons. Quite a lot regarding how little and tiny it is. Only 2,302 kilometres in diameter. Our moon's temperature minus 231 degrees. We will be going up to minus 251 degrees. And, you, and yeah, we're going to be discovering more. You never know. The new Horizon spacecraft might discover more out here. But we'll be coming in July. I do like a flight pass showing what it will see or something. To the spot. This is Pluto. We don't know any, really anything about it. Not got good pictures yet, which is all mostly of the service is just a guess. Well, of course, an educated guess, but it's so Okay, let's just turn around and wait while we go upside down.
only part of this solar system, this is the only part of the universe we've ever explored. And this bit is still uncharted by most, because this bit is still uncharted, and no one knows about it. We're so far out. We're so far out of the solar system. So small. Two moons. Very one shape. This is... Now I should be the other. Anyway, don't worry. Here is one of his, one of four Mia's moons. Let's go up to it. Tiny in diameter. Still a big one. Let's go up to it. Let's close it. And then. in 56 kilometers a second to the moon. When we did a zebra chow here, such a long way out of anything, years to get here by any of us, civilized world, it will take years to get here. This is one. Well, one of his moons. Anyway, I'm actually having to speed up this video a bit more, but we're going to want to make make. I'm a make. Make make. Make 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 make. I'm gonna make and make. That's what you call it. Make make. Make make time. Let's go make and make. Anyway. Yeah, but these are definitely dwarf plants just because of how small they are. It's closing in there, but as you can see, it's so far away out. Yeah, but it's far end of the universe. Of the universe. Of the solar system. Far end of the universe. I'll get very small. We have to remember. The universe is uncharted, it's warm to be infinite, but it's infinite. Then, you just think about it, each of these stars, that one, that one, even that one, all of them, all of them, all like this, repeated all the time. All of these little dots are one of these again. When you look at the night, you better just think about our solar system and just go in there. All of them have the same. Maybe not exactly the same. Yeah. Amazing. Anyway, that's but here we are. I'm playing the On the surface of it. Is it got any moons? Yeah, okay. I want to stop the state by different kinds of system. I want to get out of here and just say, this is make make. I'm on make make, not on a star. Thanks.
two. Now we're back to the earth. How far away are we there? Now this is our solar system. This is where we live. This is all motion was ever known. But suddenly, you look at the four expanses of the universe like that. You can just see the signs of it. Sizes of it. So you've got the Sun, Jupiter, Uranus, Saturn, Neptune, Earth, Venus, Mars. And look, Ganymede is about the same size as Mars, Jupiter's biggest moon. Bigger than Mercury. Mercury could be a moon. Then look, if you look at our moon, about the same size as Mercury. And bigger than Pluto, much bigger than Pluto. And then I hate to get all the other moons and stuff. But there we go. That is our solar system. Actually, it might need a screenshot in an artistic point, doesn't it? Anyway, but, I'm out of time. It's probably going to be a two-part video, but you just need to remember in life that we are... This is the solar system. This is all we know. But anyway, thanks for watching. Please comment, like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.